Electrified San Diego's most accurate forecast. This is 10 News Pinpoint Weather. Nothing better to talk the weather than the sight of wiener dogs, right? <laughs> and sweaters. It I like the sweaters. It makes you feel good. Yeah, that's right. Before uh, we get really freezing and get this <laughs> freezing this forecast. They have the right ideas with those sweaters, <laughs> I'll tell you what. And you know what? They can have some wet paws tomorrow afternoon as well. We've got some rain in the forecast, and wait till you see the seven-day forecast. We were talking about Santa Ana winds last week. I'm talking about them again and some very cold air. We'll get started with our nice shot looking out toward Del Mar. Clear out there this evening, no marine layer, no clouds, and not much in the way of wind. That's our downtown sky cam. Nice shot there. 51 right now at Lindbergh and no wind. So when we have no wind, the temperature drops quickly and it is going to be another chilly night. We're already at 30 in Ramona, 28 in Julian, Escondido 39. Look at El Cajon 36. You will drop into the 20s in some of the colder valleys for several hours. Oceanside already down to 35. Temperature changed from 24 hours ago, 17 degrees cooler in Ramona, same for Alpine, five in Carlsbad and nine at Oceanside. So the frost advisory is in place through eight o'clock tomorrow morning for the inland locations as well as the deserts. And of course, across the mountains, you know we have some frost there as well tomorrow morning. So we expect several hours of this. The cold air sits up in the mountains, settles into the valleys. If the wind was there, it would mix things up and we wouldn't have temperatures dropping quite so low. But for three to five hours, temperatures dropping to 28 to 35 degrees. So yeah, if you hopefully you covered the vegetation, brought the pets in. It's the second night we're seeing this. Here's the storm that I'm watching for some showers beginning tomorrow afternoon. Cold as well. So we wake up to frost. We'll get some light scattered showers during the afternoon. And then after that, on Thursday and Friday, low pressure sets down to our south, high to our north. Clockwise rotation around the high, counterclockwise around the low gives us those dry Santa Ana winds on Thursday and Friday. So we'll watch those closely for you because we know how dangerous that gets for us as far as fires. Rain futurecast 3 p.m. tomorrow. Look at snow Mount Laguna as well as Sunrise Highway. It'll get down to 3,000 feet. So places like Julian, yeah, maybe a little bit of snow for you tomorrow afternoon. All right, so tonight, Rial, let me you see these lows. All right, first of all, <laughs> Rain only about a quarter of an inch or so for Oceanside and La Jolla. And by the way, if you're going to see the game, the Holiday Bowl, yeah, it should be nice and rather cool. All right, Wisconsin here, 48, uh, about uh, 7.30, U.S. taking on USC tonight. 25 in Rona, 32 in Poway, lots of low 30s highs tomorrow, only into the 60s and seven, or no 70s, rather, the low 60s. Seven-day forecast, light showers tomorrow. Windy on Thursday and Friday. It's already the new year. Can you believe it? Uh, yeah, it's time yeah. already. All right. Uh, windy on Thursday and Friday again. Light showers 59 for high tomorrow. Mountains 40s 58 for the deserts. Yeah, another cold one tomorrow. Get Hard ready. to watch. I know. <laughs> <laughs> Hard to see. Ah, uh, Painful to watch. Yes, exactly. <laughs> All right. Thanks, Greg. You got it.